Welcome to Wisdom Trek with Grams. We are on day 1,959 of our trek, and it is time to explore another nugget of wisdom, which includes an inspirational quote, along with some wise words from Grams for today's trek. Wisdom is the final frontier in gaining true knowledge. So we are on our daily trek to create a legacy of wisdom, to seek out discernment and insights, and to boldly grow where few have chosen to grow before. Hello, my friend. This is Gramps. Thanks for coming along in today's trek as we increase wisdom and create a living legacy. We are told in Proverbs chapter 16, verse 16, How much better to get wisdom than gold and sound judgment than silver. If you apply the words that you hear today, over time, it will help you to become more healthy, wealthy, and wise as you continue on your daily trek of life. So let's jump right in with today's nugget. And today's quote is from Ray Lamy, and it is, Almost all aggravation we face daily is caused by other people. No one can aggravate us unless we internalize it. They do need our cooperation to succeed. So today's nugget is aggravation. Living, working, or playing with others is challenging without becoming aggravated at some point. Some people will aggravate us more, some less. Even the best of marriages will have aggravation at times. We will even aggravate ourselves, but when that happens, we usually take it out on others. The secret to minimizing or avoiding aggravation is not to internalize it. Every time we become aggravated with ourselves or others, it is because we choose to internalize that aggravation. Once we allow it to be planted within us, it will grow like a wildfire whipped up by the winds. We must choose not to fan the flames of aggravation that we have internalized. Instead, we must let it go. Unless something results in loss of life or limb for us or others, it's just not worth the aggravation. I know it's not easy, but it may be easier than carrying the heavy burden aggravation weighs us down with. Instead, fill your minds with good, godly, and worthwhile things. And our passage for today is Philippians chapter 4, verses 4-9. through 9. Always be full of joy in the Lord. I will say it again, rejoice. Let everyone see that you are considerate in all you do. Remember, the Lord is coming soon. Don't worry about anything. Instead, pray about everything. Tell God what you need and thank Him for all He has done. Then you will experience God's peace, which exceeds anything we can understand. His peace will guard your hearts and minds as you live in Christ Jesus. And now, dear brothers and sisters, one final thing. Fix your thoughts on what is true and honorable and right and pure and lovely and admirable. Think about things that are excellent and worthy of praise. Keep putting them into practice all you've learned and received from me, everything you heard from me and saw me doing. Then the God of peace will be with you. And as you ponder this nugget of wisdom for yourself, please encourage your friends and family to join us and to come along with us tomorrow for another day of Wisdom Trek, Creating a Legacy. If you'd like to listen to any of the past 1,958 treks or read the Wisdom Journals, they are all available at wisdom-trek.com. In addition, I encourage you to subscribe to Wisdom Trek on your favorite podcast player so that each day will be downloaded to you automatically. And if you'd also like to receive our weekly newsletter called Wisdom Notes, please email me at guthrie at wisdom-trek.com. And thank you so much for allowing me to be your guide, your mentor, but most importantly... I am your friend, as I serve you through the Wisdom Trek Podcast and Journal each day. And as we take this trek of life together, let us always live abundantly, love unconditionally, listen intentionally, learn continuously, lend to others generously, lead with integrity, and leave a living legacy each day. I am Guthrie Chamberlain reminding you to keep moving forward, enjoy your journey, and create a great day every day. See you next time for more Daily Wisdom.